Yo, what's up, guys? I Shogi here, back with another gameplay commentary. And I apologize again on behalf of my absence. It's been, I don't know, a week now. Or a week and a half since I've uploaded a legit video. I posted my giveaway winner video however many days ago. And I did get that shipped yesterday. I was going to ship it two days ago. But I got to the post office and it said, Have a good Columbus Day. And I hope all of you celebrated Columbus Day, as I know all Americans do. But, uh... Yeah, it's been a it's been a good week. I'm on fall break now. I have two weeks of that. I don't know however many of you w dogs have two weeks of fall break, but it feels pretty good. Just spent the night at my friend Ben's house, and we watched we worked on our speech piece because he's my duo partner. And then we woke up this morning at like 11:30, and his whole family was gone because his sister was having some surgery on her whatever muscle in her leg. So we worked out, and I'd never bench pressed before. But I did that, and uh, it hurt really bad. I think I was benching about 300 kilograms. Uh, no exaggeration. It's like 600 pounds. I could do it with one hand if if you asked me to. I'm actually Superman. But uh, I don't really know what I was going to talk about. I think I was just going to go through my week. I had a race last Saturday, and I rode twice. And after my first race, which was in the A-boat, which had my our three other good rowers on the novice team, we were coming back to dock at the end of the course, and there were two girls who were on our team who row in a pair, which is two two rowers with one oar, and their boat flipped off the dock because getting into the boat, uh, they grabbed their oars, but one of the girls didn't tighten their oar lock, so the oar immediately came out of the oar lock, and their boat was off balance, and it flipped, and they were both submerged. And I was trying not to laugh. But it was one of those things where you know you shouldn't laugh, but you do. Kind of like if you see someone trip on the stairs, or you like gawk. Kind of like that. It was really funny. And they were in a boat called the Poppy, because I know you care. Then I rode after that in, uh, in the 8, the B boat, which has 8 rowers, because we don't have enough for one good 8 with uh, all good novice rowers. And uh, it was the most dramatic ending, I think, ever for um, a head race in novice eights and a head race is where um, boats start like a few seconds behind each other and then you go for time uh, as opposed to like a, a sprint which will be more of spring season races where you all start at the same time like you see in the Olympics uh, and uh, at the end of the race there were three boats lined up we were in the middle and uh, there was a boat on either side of us and we were just ahead of the one to our left and well, I'd say a few few yards ahead of the boat to our left and uh, one of the kids on our boat, his seat came off of its tracks. So in like the last 40 yards, this guy's trying to put his seat back on. Then like other people catch crabs, which is where like their oar, they lose control of their oar basically. So uh, we're down to like six people rowing at a time while other people get control of their oars. One guy, the guy whose seat uh, who, that fell off, he can't even get his seat back on before the end of the race. And our coach talked to him afterwards about how he should have just kept rowing since we were that close. But it was just a super intense. I've never pulled that hard, especially in, like my second race. It was freaking intense. And uh, just wondering out how you all are doing today. Probably just going to find a quick gameplay and have you guys watch it. I have to row later today as well. I have rowing through November 1st. And I'm trying my hardest to unlock this phone to see how long I've talked. But the button on my dad's iPhone is all jank, jankopotamus. I think I'm going to let you guys go. Just have a short commentary and uh, have a good day. Alright, what's up guys? It's your boy. I figured I'd add this story on to the end since I've got the time. Uh, it's a short story that I just wanted to talk about because I forgot it in the commentary, in all honesty. But I was walking back to my friend's house with my boy Brian because we were out on a walk taking a break from our Breaking Bad marathon. You can take a look at my background if you want. And, uh, like, I figured my dad would come and get me soon, because I hadn't replied to his messages in a while. And I ended up spending the night, just in case you're curious. But he, uh, this car pulls up, and it's the same car that uh, my mom drives. And I figured, oh, he's just driving that, because it's there. And, uh, like, it stops right next, like, it pulls up and stops next to us. And, uh, like, I walk up to it, like, waiting for my dad to pull down the window. And, uh, he doesn't do that. The, the woman actually opens the door and I can see smoke coming out of it. She was hot boxing, if you're familiar with that verb. And uh, this girl was just like, Ugh. and I just started running. It was really funny. I was trying so hard not to laugh. I was stunned and shocked at the same time. 
as soon as I realized what happened, I just started running and laughing really hard. Oh.